Hello guys. Uh, in this video actually I am going to tell you about how to refer Word document or paper or journal uh, in your Word document. Uh, and it's really easy and quickest way to do it. Actually I have been working in field of scientific research since many years. And actually in, initially it was a tedious and cumbersome job if we need to type uh, the paper name, journal name, issue, volume, number, date, authors and etc. Uh, for each and every reference that we have in our report or journal paper. So, and if the order of the references changes, suppose if we are in process of writing and if the order changes, uh, if, we, if we include something before or afterwards, then the order of the reference number changes. And then it becomes a very tedious job to track the changes of, uh, of this reference and especially if it is in a number form say uh, like this suppose this is a this is a typical journal paper so it has many references okay so the ref uh, it becomes tedious job to change the number of a reference number suppose this is a reference number 33 so and suppose if i have written anything above it and it includes another reference I have added another reference that the, the number changes. So keeping track of this reference number is very tedious if, if you have to do it manually. Now there is a easier way and automatic way by which you can do all these things. And believe me, it's just a matter of seconds, matter of just a clicks, few clicks, and you are done with it. So there is no need to type paper number, journal name general name and other thing, other parameters like I, I don't have to type paper name, author name, uh, journal name, uh, volume, page number, year of publication etc. There is no need to track changes uh, in, the referred, in the referred item if there is any change you have to make a prior or before it which includes reference, new references and the process of making a bibliography or references is also automatic. Like I did not make all these things references manually. The process can be done completely automatic. So let me straight away take you to the, uh, the software that I am using. And that software is a Mendeley software. You can you can freely download the software from www.mendeley.com. Uh, I have downloaded it and this is a typical uh, look of the software. Uh, the software is available in the exe format for word mac and as well as linux so you can download the software from here home so you can download it web installer you can get an installer for this uh, i have downloaded it and installed it if from here you can download it second thing is it it also has a web importer suppose if you're browsing some paper on a web and you quickly need to refer it so it gives a plugin for chrome firefox safari and other things so that also you can add it i am using chrome and this plugin i have already installed in my chrome you can, if you're not if you're new to it you can just go to this this page link and install this plugin since this plugin is already installed you can see it over here this is manly plugin and this is a manly software now i'll just show you a quick demo how the software is useful to us now suppose let us say i went to a science direct now this is the most famous place where you will find the research articles now I've already searched this heat and mass transfer. Let us say this is a typical paper that I, that I want to refer. Now what I can do is I can just go to Mindly Importer on your web browser and just click. Okay, it will ask for which paper to download. Suppose this is a paper that effect of heat and mass transfer. I want to download that, uh, that material that is used for referencing, for referring this document. That is typed paper name, name of journal, volume, issue and pages and authors and other things suppose let uh, this i've already done it before before you uh, test whether this is working before this video now suppose i want to refer the second second article so i'll just click 
and suppose if PDF is available I can ask Mandalay to download PDF for me and save it so I have just clicked here and save it now it is saved now how do I get all this reference in my Mandalay desktop now before doing this you just have while installing it will ask for your login ID so I have logged in from my ID in this web importer or importer uh, plugin in Chrome and with same ID I have logged in into my uh, Mendeley desktop version now if I just have to press synchronize button and see this paper is, is here if the, if you find that some details are not correct you can just edit it and I found that details is correct I will say correct so this is one of the method second you don't need to go to each go to science direct even if it works with this plugin works well with Google Scholar now this is a typical Google Scholar I have searched for his Higgs boson okay now there are typical papers some articles some text some books or any or any various types of uh, resources so I just need to click here again on the Mendeley plugin it will search for something and then suppose I want to see uh, I want to refer this upper bound of the lightest boson mass or yeah this is it I'll just say okay so I will check this save it has already saved I will go to my desktop version I'll just say so it refresh it so see this has already come over here okay if you want to edit something and just go to that article and edit over here okay now there is another thing suppose you download some, downloaded some paper you can import the text into this, this manly software uh, and, um, into this thing I will just import uh, add files I'll add files of the already downloaded paper these are the two downloaded paper that I have that I have downloaded I'll say add and this is that thing these two papers have already come up it will automatically read uh, the appropriate uh, title authors year of publication and another, other things required now, this is a typical uh, this is that same paper effect of mass transfer uh, mass transfer heat and mass uh, transfer characteristics yes this is the thing and see how nicely it has already it has taken all the uh, required input for referencing okay so this is uh, uh, this is a uh, how to import data for referring now how to use it it also uh, I'll use this thing in report okay so while installing this Mendeley desktop version, it will ask you to to, to uh, install a plugin in your Word. So I've already done it. After installing, in the reference menu, you will have this kind of thing. These three things: insert bibliography, open Mendeley. So now I have opened Mendeley, and when the first time you will open uh, this Mendeley for uh, for referencing in Word, it will ask what kind of uh, citation, what format of citation you will need in your Word so I have already I have selected IEEE I like this okay you can choose any of uh, any one of the format that you like so suppose I have taken IEEE format I did it now the heat and mass transfer coefficient board decreases this is a typical text you will write in your report or reference or journal paper or whatever or thesis okay now here I want to insert the references now what to do is since I have already I uh, have this reference database in my mentally on my desktop I just have to press alt M now this is a shortcut key for referring now here I have to search an author search by author title or name so what I, I know that this page this text is from uh, from a paper who, uh, whose author name is Tang okay this is a thing I have selected okay and this is done if you want to add multiple papers you can do the same with the same way press all time this is first first thing then boson this is second thing let us say I want to add this thing so it's done quite easy 
in this uh, in this thing i have referred two three papers i have downloaded um, the relevant paper heading authors and all these things if you just click a button and i i never typed the author name paper name etc it was automatically fetched while doing all these things now second thing is how to write how to insert us uh, insert a bibliography this is just like what you have to just press this insert bibliography and you are done see how easy it is thank you for watching this video if you like this please share it and subscribe so that i can further i can make further videos okay thank you very much for watching